I started in this field working with children because I just love kids and I wanted to help kids uh, uh, know that they were these beautiful little beings. And I was working at Children's Day Treatment Center and after working there for a while, um, we also work with families. I realized, well, you know, it's really hard working with these little children and then sending them back into these families where it's kind of messed up. <laughs> and I felt like I was just like scratching the surface. So then I went into family therapy and I studied family therapy and now I've honed it down to couples work because I feel if we as couples can get clear on what is the work that we have to do within ourselves and with our, our matedom, that our children are watching they are imprinting, and what I find in, in our adult life is we reenact what we saw, what was done to us, or what we were allowed to get w away with in our relational patterns with our mates, and our children are watching. So when I work with people, it's a lot about healing the, the, the aspects, these five aspects that we weren't taught as children, and our parents didn't have the amount of psychology, child development skills, all the stuff that we have available to us now weren't so available when we were growing up. Some people got more of it. They had, you know, families that were, that, you know, had more health, had less crises, had less illnesses of whatever sort. So everybody's got some range of from, uh, uh, got some to didn't get much. And so what I like to do, tell people is we can all reparent ourselves. We all need to reparent ourselves so that we can show up relationally for our, ourselves first, our mate second, and our children third. When we don't take really good care of the adult relationships, um, the children suffer. So and being in the trenches when it's so hard to be taking care of um, the relationship when you're like really having to take care of the kids who are so immediate and so needful. But if we're not finding a balance to say, what about you and I, sweetie? And what about me? I mean, it's this incredible juggling act. And there, I, I just want to say there's never enough time. And that's one of the things where it's like, wh where do we pull this out of our baby toes? And I'm like, yep. Sometimes.